Well, we're now two and a half weeks into stage four restrictions in Melbourne. And firstly, I hope everyone's getting through it okay. I hope you're looking out for each other and, of course, reaching out for help if you need it. And if we all stick together, we will get through this over the next few weeks. Well, the first two weeks have seen a lot of activity, which is what we expected. First of all, buyers and sellers looking to get deals done before the lockdown happened. Agents still streaming auctions from their offices. And then, of course, the very strange side over the last couple of Saturdays of agents doing auctions live from their lounge rooms with their assistants calling in and transmitting bids through the earpieces. So let's have a look at what's happened during those first two weeks. Across the Barry Plant Group, we've signed an amazing 307 deals during the first two weeks of lockdown, and we've also achieved a 96% clearance rate on our auctions. We've also been able to facilitate a further 303 settlements of properties that were previously sold, and in addition to those sales and settlements, we've also listed 199 new properties for sale. So whilst it's not quite business as usual, we are able to get on with the business of helping people keep a roof over their heads during this current lockdown, and we're certainly not taking a holiday. The other pleasing thing is that there is still high demand out there, which is seeing some good prices achieved. Just to give you one example, we saw a great auction in South Morang, where we had seven registered bidders, with four of them providing no less than 75 bids with an advertised price range of 620000 to 680000 It was finally sold for 741000 which was 61000 above the reserve. Even more interesting was the fact that the underbidder on this property had not done a physical inspection of the property prior to the auction. Well, first of all, we need to understand the facts and then we can talk about what we expect to see based on what we know. Firstly, we know that buyer inquiry and interest is very strong, with realestate.com.au reporting a year-on-year 90% -year increase for digital inspection video views on their website and a 29% increase for searches in the buy side section. We also know that in July and the first two weeks of August, we sold over 1,000 properties and many of those sellers now need to buy, which is also underpinning the strong demand. We know that the number of listings available on the market has decreased by approximately 10% over the past four weeks, leading to further competition for the available properties. And finally, if we look ahead to what is likely to happen once we come out of lockdown, the New Zealand experience is the best guide, where there was huge rush of activity in the first few weeks when there were very few properties on the market. So, based on that information, we think that there'll be a big rush of activity when we come out of lockdown in the Melbourne market, we think there'll be a large pool of buyers who'll be looking to act quickly and there'll be strong competition for the small number of homes that will initially be on the market. So given everything we know now, I would urge prospective sellers to act now for two reasons. The first one is that we know it takes about four weeks to get a property ready to go onto the market. And the second one is that many sellers will be waiting to see what happens when we come out of lockdown. And that means there'll be less homes on the market, which means that your home will stand out even more. So we think that between the middle of September and the middle of October, your home will have less competition from other homes on the market, which means a higher price. But then after mid-October, we think the number of homes on the market will increase significantly, which means more choice for buyers and less competition for your home. Across the Barry Plant Network, we have a clear strategy and process for conducting virtual appraisals over the next four weeks. So call your local Barry Plant office to see how we can help you.